Good morning, Ray. KD2IBP. Today's the 5th of March, 2021, 4 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time. And uh, I am going to start with my medication and vital record keeping regimen at 4. Uh, I'm going to shift it by two hours because I want to get back onto the schedule that I'd normally be on while we're going to work. I don't want to. Uh, shift things around, and then have to reacclimate to the work schedule. I'm going to get to work as soon as possible, as soon as all this bullshit's done. <coughs> so, first thing I do on a daily basis, this is a day two home, without my nurses, I'm my own nurse right now. So I learned a lot from watching them every freaking four hours. Took my weight to 35.2. Weight uh, take my temperature. 96.9 All good in the hood I think I'm going to do an albutrol It's a little early I, I did a, a shot of this at 2 I'm going to double up, fuck it, I don't really care Just get back on track When I was young, I'd be able to pull bong hits. Nobody's business. Go and rip them, ripping tubes. Now I couldn't do a fucking bong hit. I'm lucky if I could pull 250 milliliters of uh, air. But my lungs are still all screwed up. I feel like I'm running off one lung here. The oxygen's been really good. I have been moving around non-stop since I've been home. Nancy's yelling at me all the time. I just can't sit still. 129 over 80. Uh, 99 pulse, which is a little high. But I've been moving around again. Blood oxygen concentration. Really good, 96. 96%. And that's it. Pretty sure I'm at 3 milliliters. Excuse me, 3 liters per hour, a minute of oxygen. And this is my cough med. I'm supposed to take this shit three times a day. Helps break up the mucus in the lungs. If there is any. Steroid. Open up the bronchial tubes once a day. And we have uh, two more doses after this. Maybe Doc will prescribe more, I don't know. Utero, cough, check, steroid, check, some saline solution, it's basically a cal sodium chloride solution. Keeps 
just a nasal passage is why way it's clear. I don't remember. Did I do a two count on that uh, little mini bong here or did I do one? Never heard of OD and I'll put you a trail, so let's do it again. Yep, a little handy satchel here. my stuff back and not lose it. I put it ten times yesterday. I'm gonna skip on the uh, custom DM because I did that at two o'clock. <coughs> Coughing pretty good. Hand sanitizer. And that's it folks. I do this four times a day. Until I'm out of my meds. I see my doctor on Thursday, 7 a.m. See what he says. How we move forward from here. But I'm feeling pretty good. I gotta be honest with you, I went to sleep with the oxygen on last night and uh, had the alarm set so when the tubes fell out of my nose, which they actually did, an alarm would sound. But, you know, there was always that part, part of my head. Um, I was waking up thinking that I was getting an embolism in my lungs. And, uh, you know, a clot set free. It's really just paranoia. Just past experience with my buddy Danny, as I explained earlier. Uh, but it's still in the back of my head all the time. Worst thing in the world I could ever do to Nancy and the kids is uh, die. You know? I don't know, they may be back to death or who the fuck knows. But, uh, it's always at the top of my head. Listen, I'm going to uh, carry on uh, and uh, go along with my day. Make another cup of coffee without having to call it in at 7 a.m. The hospital. Great. All right, so uh, enjoy your morning. It's going to be a beautiful week. Um, it's supposed to be pretty clear. It's going to be cold at night, you know, cool during the day, but who cares? It's still beautiful. Um, 73 for now. And... Uh, Bye-bye, guys. KD2YPP clear.